Hi, here in beautiful Baltimore today, my name is Sarah Reeves and I'm the Women's Lacrosse Product Line Manager. So the highlight really originated uh, two years ago when we had our, one of our All-American Lacrosse games and where we first introduced the men's highlight version. Um, so a lot of the girls when we have our distribution, they were noticing that the guys were getting this product that was unique and different and higher up and they wanted to try it. They wanted to try something different that they, where they traditionally are wearing a low or a mid. Um, so we let a lot of the girls wear it and the feedback that we got was that they really, really liked it and it was something different. Um, so that was where we kind of uh, lightning in the bottle, we decided we wanted to add it into the women's line. So uh, this is our first women's highlight that we'll have. It's an eyelet lower than the men's, um, but it, when you adjust it based off the height of a female athlete, it's, it's around the same height. Um, so it definitely gives you that locked in fit and feel, um, and it really originated from our great uh, assets that we have coming in our, our uh, high school girls at our All-American. This past season at the All-American Lacrosse game, 90% of the girls selected the women's highlight, where a lot of them, probably only about two of the girls had come in ever wearing the, women, uh, the men's highlight version. So a lot of the testing that we did with the women's highlight, we have eight of the top 25 teams um, this past season. So we've had a lot of success and we have some of the best assets that we can get feedback from. Um, so when we were first coming out with the women's highlight, we wanted to make sure that we were testing with some of these properties. So Northwestern was definitely one of our first assets that we test with. Um, Notre Dame, we had them come in here when they transitioned out of their last um, deal with another com competitor. Um, we had the girls come in and we had the highlights for them to actually try them on. So a lot of them were really, really excited to try something that was different and unique. And as soon as they, they put it on out, out of the box, they definitely fell in love with it. So when you look at the this past season, a lot of the women's Notre Dame girls were wearing this uh, women's highlight. Um, for the first Big Ten matchup with Maryland and Northwestern this past season, we did some really cool uh, colors for Maryland and Northwestern, and they were a lot of these girls were wearing the women's highlight because they wanted to wear something different and unique um, with a really cool look on field. So we know that there, we've established a, a highlight version, a franchise in men's, whether it's in men's lacrosse or it's in men's football. So we know that we have something that we can establish across all of our women's sports, not just women's lacrosse specifically, but we know that there's a player out there that wants something that's more innovative, um, a little bit different than where they have in the past with a mid or a low. Um, so we know that with this, we can look to build off of for future seasons, um, a highlight franchise, maybe not just with a molded cleat.